It's always heartwarming to see celebrity couples in love. And these inspiring celebrity couples prove to us all that love has no boundaries. So we've compiled a hot list of Hollywood's most adorable LGBT couples. Some of the celebs on this list really surprised us, but they all show us that really prove that love is love. Before we proceed, please subscribe and don't forget to click the notification bell down below and leave your comments and suggestions. Ellen DeGeneres and Portia de Rossi. Who better to begin with than the hilarious comedians actresses Ellen DeGeneres and Portia de Rossi. Yes, everyone adores Ellen on her talk show. Meanwhile, Portia is a model, philanthropist and actress, you probably know her from Arrested Development with Jason Bateman and David Cross. Portia and Ellen began dating several years ago and in 2008, they got married. Did you know Ellen got the Presidential Medal of Freedom due to her efforts to advance LGBT rights? Jonathan Knight and Harley Rodriguez While new kids on the block star Jonathan Knight and actor Harley Rodriguez were on an episode of The Jenny McCarthy Show they announced their engagement. Knight explained, we were in Africa, our parents were there, our moms were there, and I just figured this was the time to pop the question and make it official. Lance Bass and Michael Turchin. Lance Bass became a star with the 90s group, In Sync. In 2011, he started dating a painter named Michael Turchin. Then three years later, they got married on live TV, making them the first same-sex couple to marry on live television. Lance loves Michael, the Lance Bass wedding is one for the books. Cynthia Nixon and Christine Marinoni. Sex and the City star Cynthia Nixon is in her early 50s thriving. She's married to Christine Marinoni, an education activist. The two met back in 2004 and married in. Now, they have a son, Max. Jodie Foster and Alexandra Hedison. Director, actress Jodie Foster is a legend. This Yale graduate is married to Alexandra Hedison. Hedison is also an actress and director and also an artist. However, that's about all you'll really hear about them, they keep their relationship very private. Adam Lambert and Sawley Koskinen. Adam Lambert got his claim to fame for his appearance on American Idol in the show's eighth season, he was runner-up. Reality TV star Sawley Koskinen and Adam began dating in 2010. The two went the separate ways, dot, but we're glad to hear they're still friends. T.R. Knight and Patrick Leahy. Recognize T.R. Knight from the hit show Grey's Anatomy. Sounds about right. T.R. and boyfriend Patrick Leahy finally tied the knot in 2013, just three years after meeting. Lily Tomlin and Jane Wagner. Lily Tomlin hit her stride back in the 60s. She's a renowned actress, singer, producer, writer and comedian. Back in 1971, she met Jane Wagner, a writer, while recording a comedy record together. The two have been together for over 40 years. They got married on December 31 in 2013. Queen Latifah and Jeanette Jenkins. She might just be your favorite actress, but with all the laughs that Queen Latifah is capable of causing, there is some sorrow. She dated personal trainer Jeanette Jenkins for quite a while, they started out in 2002 and then got engaged officially in 2008. Sadly everything ended in 2014 when they decided that they weren't meant for each other. So sad. Chris Hughes and Sean Eldridge. Sean Eldridge is a U.S. political activist and married Chris Hughes, the co-founder of Facebook in 2012. The power couple look super cute here with their matching smiles and matching suits. Anderson Cooper and Benjamin Mazzani. America's favorite news anchor Anderson Cooper was dating Benjamin Mazzani, a bar owner, for nine years. Sadly, these two ended things in 2018. Bob Harper and Anton Gutierrez. Fans got a really exciting wake-up call in November of 2015. Bob Harper and Anton Gutierrez made it public that they were in a long-term committed relationship. 
During episode 7 of season 15 of The Biggest Loser, Harper helped a contestant come out to his family, I guess it's easy to find love and compatibility in someone who truly shares your values. Kristen Stewart and Stella Maxwell. Talk about a power couple. Naturally, you know Kristen Stewart from her movies like the Twilight series. Meanwhile, Stella Maxwell is known for modeling with Victoria's Secret. These two have been dating since 2016. Tom Ford and Richard Buckley. From his self-titled brand to directing, producing and screenwriting, is there anything Tom Ford can't do? Clearly, he has it all, including a fabulous love life. He's been with magazine editor Richard Buckley since 1986. In 2014, the two exchanged vows. Neil Patrick Harris and David Burtka. Another iconic LGBT couple, we have Neil Patrick Harris and David Burtka. Although they began dating some time ago, they only revealed their engagement after give years. Now, the two are married and have twins, Harper and Gideon. Heather Matarazzo and Heather Terman. The Princess Diaries star Heather Matarazzo and comedian Heather Terman are another couple who prefer privacy the two are dating and supposedly. Elton John and David Furnish. Famous English singer and songwriter Elton John and his beau David Furnish met in 1993. David is impressive in his own right, a successful filmmaker. The couple entered a civil partnership in 2005 and later married on December 21, 2014. Sarah Paulson and Holland Taylor. If it's true love, there is no obstacle great enough to stand in its way. Even though Holland Taylor turns 76 in January 2019, she's dating 45-year-old actress Sarah Paulson of American Horror Story. Hey, whatever works for them. Chris Colfer and Will Sherrod. 28-year-old Chris Colfer really made heads turn on the set of Glee. He found love with 36-year-old actor Will Sherrod, and they've been together ever since 2013. Will they get married anytime soon? Or at all? Well, we'll just have to wait and see. Cara Delevingne and Ashley Benson. Speaking of models, Cara Delevin made her very own modeling debut in 2009. Now, she's one of the highest paid models in the world. Back in the day, she was dating Annie Clark, who you know as musician St. Vincent. However, now everyone is talking about her rumored romance with actress Ashley Benson of Pretty Little Liars. Ashley Benson herself confirmed their dating. Congrats to the lovely couple. Sam Smith and Brandon Flynn. The UK chart-busting singer Sam Smith recently and the 13 reasons why actor Brandon Flynn made their relationship public. We are curious to know more, but the famous duo are keeping their relationship out of the spotlight for now. Gillian Michaels and Heidi Rhodes. Remember Gillian Michaels from The Biggest Loser and He's Just Gillian. While she was on that show, she met Heidi Rhodes, her talent manager, and proposed to her. Now, they have two kids. Barry Manilow and Gary Keefe. Barry Manilow has been working in the music industry for more than 50 years. That's pretty impressive. He's also been dating TV executive and manager Gary Keefe since 1978. Actually, once same-sex marriage became legal in California, they got married in 2014. Cheyenne Jackson and Jason Landau. Back in 2013, actors Cheyenne Jackson and Jason Landau announced their relationship on Instagram. So millennial, right. A year later, they got married. In October 2016, the couple welcomed twins, Willow and Ethan, into the world.